great day because the doctors brought us scones. Oh my gosh, okay. So, get my life together for a sec. Like sit for a sec, you know? Okay, let's drive over to job number two. I feel like I'm in a very blah mood and I'm like not very like my usual happy self, but I'm honestly just drained, guys. I've worked like 60 hours this week and I am just, I'm drained. Like, I'm not gonna lie. I am so beyond tired and like, it's definitely just like a little stressful and tense and it's starting to uh, to make me anxious a little bit. It's weird to see the hospital. Like, it's very eerie and quiet and with no visitors and stuff. The hospital's pretty empty, but just trying to make the most of it but I'd like be lying to you guys if I said I just wasn't like a little anxious and stressed about it but I'm gonna go park near the parking lot now head over to Chio check my emails and stuff I'm gonna change just because I'm wearing like my hospital sweater from here and I feel like weird going over there even though I'm literally not gonna see a single human about 5.15. I've been here for about an hour and a little bit. Um, I just did some emails and just caught up on my emails for the day. I'm just reading an email. I'm gonna go upstairs and get dinner, I think. This is like so unlike me to buy food and I've never like bought so much food in the last week, but I just, I'm trying to avoid the grocery store. So I'm gonna go upstairs and see what they have. It's probably either a sandwich or pizza, but yeah. I just got back from buying my dinner. It's so weird because I like never buy food anymore, but I was like, you know what girl? You're going on an hour. We're 48 of work in four days. So you know what? You can buy yourself dinner. So I bought myself a Gatorade and then I caved at the cash and I bought myself this cute little cookie. It's a ham and veggie sub on some cheese bread. So I'm gonna eat that. I'm gonna eat this super quick and then just get back on to email. So that's my fun little update. between my laptop and then a big computer um, for work but that's my little update look at this cute little plant guys I think it's so cute oh my goodness I'm obsessed with it so I'm actually was getting ready to leave but I realized I have a little bit of schoolwork to do so I'm actually going to stay just for a little bit just read through some lecture slides just because like I have this big desk and why not utilize it like I'm already here so I have my laptop out and I'm just gonna go over some slides for like a little bit and then head home but that's my little update I'm done work and I just want to do some slides really quick because I'm already here and like set up so I may as well stay and get a little bit of school work done basically since coffee shops and stuff are closed and you guys know that I love to go to coffee shops and get work done just because I don't focus well at home I'm trying to any day like today where I have like even a tiny bit of energy to just stay after work and like just get some lecture stuff done I'm really trying to not fall behind I know it's so easy to fall behind especially if you're in online classes right now um, and like you are still privileged to work like I am it's so easy for me to fall behind and like just then get screwed during final so i'm really trying to keep up on top of my lectures weekly and maybe like not so much to vote so 
maybe not devote so much time right now into studying um but i am going to this week i think just because i'm gonna be it's obvious i'm gonna have a very busy next few weeks of work i'm gonna try and just like get ahead for the rest of the semester and all my online assignments so my online class that i already had online not a big deal but my two other classes moved online obviously with coronavirus and I have weekly assignments. So I honestly just wanna try and get everything done and focus on work, but I'm really trying to stay on top of my lectures. That's super important to me. So anyways, I'm gonna pack up and head home and I'll probably talk to you guys when we get home. I'm really excited to work out. I am so looking forward to it. I'm not gonna lie, it's a few days later. I've been working like crazy, but I wanted to include a fun small unboxing at the end of this video for you guys. That night, that day that I was filming a few days ago, I literally came home and I crashed. Like I didn't work out or anything, if I'm being honest. The whole thing has just taken like a toll on my sleep. So anyways, I have some packages to unbox, which I figured I would do on camera because those are so fun to do. And I don't want this to come across as bragging in any way, shape or form. I debated talking about this and even debated like buying stuff right now because honestly, like, I know a lot of people are out of a job right now, and I think it's very unfair for me to, like, sit here and, like, talk about things that I bought. But at the same time, I'm so lucky and blessed to have a job, and I've been putting in insane hours for the last week, and I feel like I just kind of deserved something. So, I did a big spring cleaning a few weeks ago and decided I kind of wanted to start doing a little bit more of, like, neutral pieces and just more, like, simple pieces. Um, so, I picked up some stuff, really excited about them, so... Yeah, I figured an unboxing it would be fun. And there's some of my favorite videos to watch. I love watching unboxings. So, I've decided to do the unboxing from my bed. Okay, let's start with American Eagle. I got a ton of stuff from Aerie, which is my favorite store. Um, I'm also going to link everything down below for you guys. Aw, oh, yeah. I'm so excited right now. Okay, so like I said, I got a bunch of like just comfy pieces. So the first thing I got, oh, these are so cute. These shirt areas, I never know what freaking size to get, man. Okay, I got these. They're supposed to be just like cute little like boxer shorts. Um, so I got these. They're one of their oversized like men's t-shirts. I literally love these. I already have two gray color shirts. I didn't really think that through. I might return this just because I already have two gray color shirts and I wasn't thinking. This is a crop top, but it's like an oversized one. So it just looks like this. I'm really excited to wear this because I've been really rocking the sweatpants lately. So I just got this, which I'll have to turn on see. The sleeves look a little long, but I'm going to try everything on after this and see how it fits. I'm really excited about these. These are kind of like some like lounging pants. I don't really know, but I might have to get these in a small. They're supposed to be like, I'll put the picture of what they're supposed to look like here. But they're basically just like super, super soft. They kind of look like a line joggers, but like with a little more like space in them. They're kind of like harem pants, I guess. I'll have to try them on and see if I like them, but they're just some black, like, harem, stretchy, soft pants. Just got this, which is just, like, a, um, like a bralette. Tara Michelle wears these in, like, all her videos, so I just got this just to chill in, and it actually had some padding, and so it's just, like, a, like, long bralette to wear with, like, some sweatpants when I'm just, like, hanging around. So, that's my cute little area unboxing. Next is Old Navy. I only wear old navy jeans. They're the only ones that fit me in my weird ass body. So I'm so excited. I'm going to wear this to work today, I think. It is just a, oh, this is so cute. I should have gotten medium though. It's like a short sleeve Henley. I don't know. I just thought it would be so cute tucked into some jeans. How friggin' cute. I just love this like salt and pepper look. I don't know. I think this would be so cute tucked into some jeans. So I'm going to have these like stretchy kind of work pants for work. So I got another pair, but these ones have like a thicker drawstring, which I like. Just this like nice black and white geometric print and then these are like a high waisted boyfriend jean i've never had boyfriend jeans before and i'm excited but they just got a little rip and they're just like little boyfriend jeans so try those on give them a go are a high waisted um raw leg jean i love jeans like this so these are just some high waisted jeans they're called the power slim um and i love jeans that are like this that just have like a little ripping in them but then look at the bottoms i love so I got those and I'm curious to see if they fit. So yeah, that's my little haul. Hope you guys enjoyed. I'm really excited about my stuff. I'm going to try all my eerie stuff on, I think, and make sure it fits. Um, and I think I'm going to start a new vlog. So I hope you guys enjoyed the little unboxing at the end of this video. Don't forget to give it a big thumbs up if you enjoyed. Subscribe if you're not already. And I'll talk to you in my next one. Bye.